Not to be broadcast is brought to you by vibe.ng. So this tea that is about to be spilled has got to be the hottest in the entertainment industry and Nigeria as a whole. And I promise there have been some scouting cops flying around lately. Is it the issue of Pastor Fatou Ibo and the fact that someone else other than Busola Dakolo has come forward to, you know, also accuse him of rape? Someone said it's Koza season two. Is it the issue? Well, it's season three now since S.A. Walter was season one. Is it the issue of Senator Elisha Abo who hit somebody, you know, at a sex store? Is it Naira Mali insulting Kafi over her disapproval of the Sopi dance? Like, a lot has really been going on. We don't need you. We're not going to use you. We don't use you. We don't use you. We won't use you. Oh, well, the latest is that Olamide Bado has a child on the way with former uh, Beat FM um, on air personality, actress, and beauty entrepreneur Maria Okan. Yep, you heard me right. Maria's baby is expected to drop in a matter of weeks. And you're also correct about the fact that Olamide's fiance just gave birth to their second son barely three days ago from this recording that is so here's the gist it is believed that olamide had an affair with maria which led to pregnancy you know almost around the time that his wife got pregnant for him too i'm not sure what the exact discussion was but maria is said to have asked for money to terminate the baby and move back to england after which olamide gave her the sum of two million naira it seems somewhere along the line, Maria had a change of heart and decided to keep the baby against the initial agreement, you know, of termination with Olamide. Some sources say Olamide's fiance is now aware of this development and has forgiven him for cheating on her. But you definitely guessed right. The debate is heated and there are many sides to it. So why was Olamide creeping with someone else when, you know, he has an engaged woman at home? Why was Maria sleeping with someone else's husband to be and more so without protection? Why has Adebukumi Aisha, that's Olamide's fiance, why has she decided to, you know, continue the relationship with Olamide after he has cheated on her and has also brought in an entire life from an external relationship? So as for Olamide cheating and why he did it, I think right now only God can really answer that, if we're being honest. We can decide to blame it on the artist factor, but the distance between the new baby and the one on the way cannot be described as anything short of recklessness. As for Maria, there's no mincing words about the fact that she made a poor choice to be with someone else's man and an even poorer choice by not preventing getting knocked up. Then there's the issue of wanting to terminate the baby and then deciding otherwise without the other party. And that's believing that, you know, this is how the story went down. Right now, people are saying that if Olamide decides not to support the baby, it will not entirely be his fault. But we're hoping that's not what the real case will be. As for Ade Bukomi, I believe she has weighed all her options and you know, she has decided to do what suits herself, her babies and her relationship best. But it seems like a really, really, really complicated issue. And I'm, I'm really, really, you know, looking forward to how it plays out. If you're listening to this, I'd like to, you know, I'd like for you to put yourself in their shoes. If you're a guy, what would you do if you were Olamide? If you're a lady, what would you do if you're Bukomi or Maria Okan? I will definitely keep you updated as the story unravels. Nothing for me. Nothing for me. Hey. Hey.